Hello and welcome, I'm Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Venetian Vengeance. So, we're trying to get more than 28 regiments. We're at 27. We need to build one more just to satisfy that mission. Let's get another longbow or two. Generally a good idea to have more infantry. Hey, Castile's fleet's coming out to play. I think theirs is a little bit more banged up than mine is. The rotten swine in Naples declared war upon us. Prepare for battle. Awesome. Perfect. So, that's fun. So now we're at war with more people. <laughs> Yay! We have gained the dishonored call Texas Valley against France. They don't dishonored our call to war. Oh man, that's going to destroy France. They just lost they should have just lost a bunch of prestige. But I can understand why they didn't want to take on the call. Apparently we just blew up ships somewhere. I want to find Castile's fleet. Because I know that it's damaged. They're retreating back this way now. Let's try to chase them. Our ships are faster because we are not... We don't have any heavies. Actually, we do have a single heavy ship, which I believe slows the speed of the whole fleet. So let's take uh, just these guys. Let's test that theory. Ah, no, we've already sent them. No, I want to know. I want to know the answer. Okay, it takes you till the 12th, 10 days, to get from this count, this sea zone to this sea zone with the heavy ship. If we get rid of the heavy ship, it still takes you to the 12th. The heavy ship gets there on the 9th. Well, that's interesting. I guess it's based on the size of the fleet. Who knows? It's weird. Weird math. So Naples is the war leader. We've wanted an excuse to attack them. Um, they haven't called in anyone except for the people that are part of the coalition, so... Looks like this is a job for Naples to come do, or my, uh, my main dude here, Mario, to come do. I'm hoping Burgundy doesn't send an army over now, because I'm going to leave this undefended. Hey there, Castile. Don't, don't try to be sneaky. Sixteenth. Eighteenth. Well, let's try to catch him. They are some fast little bastards. Second. No, we can't catch him. Alright, well, let's go fight Naples then. Naples is 983. We've got more than that. By a lot. We're also completely slaughtering their army. We protect against Austria. Yay. That's good. New mission. Achieve religious unity. It's not going to happen. It'd be really good, though. Conquer Cremona. Conquer Cremona. Well, um, we're not currently at war with Cremona. I really wish we could get rid of this stupid province that has the wrong religion. And it's going to be something I have to take care of soon. It's going to get occupied again. Hmm. Oh, we can formalize scales, weights, and measures. Flat tax bonus. It's not going to be worth it. Fully blockading this really, really hurts my income. Oh, did we lose our better relations guy? Apparently we did. Well, we can't not afford... We can't have... We have to have him. It's just we have to. Can't afford any of those. Okay, I know that we're at war. Come on home, fleet! Damn it, there goes that thing. It took him two years, almost. Continue to blow up Naples. Actually, let's just detach a siege and start going all over the place. You go ahead, Naples. You blockade me for a moment. I'm going to come kill you in... Oh yeah, by the way, I'm going to siege all of your stuff. Yeah. 
this is what I was worried about. Dang it, they are coming over. Damn. Alright, we can't afford to block to siege everything. We need to get back to Treviso. No, we lost a battle. Son of a bitch. Okay, win that naval battle so we can actually access the strait. Come on. Head to Treviso. Captured two ships. Okay, you want to come at my 5-2? I'll take you. Come on down. Fleet coming out? Yeah, it is coming out to play. Interesting. Okay, Hungry. I don't know why you got involved. I'm not happy about it. They've rivaled me now. There goes all of our friendship. All potential for it. So what are we working on? We got 52% annexation. There's a lot going on right now, isn't there? Our ships are really beat up. I need to repair them. Yeah. Capture two more. It's hard to say what we actually captured. Oh, never mind. And Austria's declared war us. <laughs> Could it get any worse? Um, so Austria is trying to take core Venezia. Interesting. How on earth do you have a conquest on Venezia? That's weird. Well, I feel like if we get to... If I just camp my army out in Venice, then no one's ever going to be able to take it. We've got a river crossing... No, it might even be safer in Treviso because of the mountains, but... That's that's annoying. That's not good. Um, the Neapolitan punitive war. I needed Aragon as an ally. I should not have broken that off. Trying to get in bed with our... Trying to make Hungary like us may have been a big mistake. Almost certain it was. Alright, so we're going to need some of this fleet to be functional though, so let's sort by condition and throw in the ones that are below 50%. Let them repair a bit. But if you're above 50%, you're coming out to play. We need to keep our ports secure. We need to get to Treviso. Form an alliance with Salzburg. Of course, they're not going to be willing to accept right now, nor would we expect them to. Now, Austria has 28 regiments. We just did the mission to actually get more than them, but I don't know if it's going to be enough. The only chance we really have is if they come at us in Treviso and just throw their men into the meat grinder. Swiss won against Burgundy. They are not willing to let me surrender. What do they actually want? They want me to release nations. Or cancel vassals. Well, maybe we could do that. We could. Um, like, which war is the worst? Okay, this is me on this side. So Burgundy, bad. Bad, bad, bad. It's a bad war. 
Austria equal. We could take on Austria if it was just me versus Austria. This one, bad. I'm actually making gains in this one. Isn't that what that just said? I thought I saw it say, yeah, Venice is making gains plus nine. Okay, so this war, I think I'm gonna have to do something to appease them. Because the war score is not gonna get much better. It's gonna get worse as they continue to carpet siege France. So what if we concede defeat? No. If I give you Tus if I release Tuscany, if I cancel Tuscany, Would actually be ideal for me to cancel Tuscany. Hmm. So if I give them, if I release Tuscany, which Cost me a diplomatic relation, and they don't really like me anyway. And I get rid of Naxos as well, which I also don't really care about at all. They just take up a relationship. And give some money, then we can get out of this war and focus on wars that matter. Anything else I can do? I'm not willing to give up any of this stuff that's in our node. The other reason is that uh, that's not part of our trade node, so who cares? I think that's it. I think I'm, I'm, yeah, let's just do it. Go away, Burgundy. Jerks. So now we got the Palatinate in Austria. We still got Savoy as part of this war. This, this war is the one that I think... So are we like way below our limit now? Check it out, that's actually good. So do we, we didn't lose stability or anything for losing vassals that way. Good, that is good. We're still gonna annex that one. Although it's occupied by rebels right now. Orthodox zealots, bah. So we can't really afford to leave Treviso, um, but What I'm hoping we can do is let's repair the fleet for a month. Plains, hills, mountains. Had to take out loans. It's to be expected. Could take on another idea. Don't really care too much about the next uh, thing. Let's go ahead and take it. Oh wait, was that a level 1 missionary strength guy? We might want him. I know this is bait. If I go to Fru Friuli, then these 20 will come in. Hungary, we can negotiate separate peace with. But to do that, we'd probably have to buy them out. Or something. No, we're not going to do that. So what I'm hoping we can do with this one, since this is, this is the tie-in for Hungary, is uh, I'm going to let the fleet repair, which it just did. Uh, we'll go ahead and create new units, or by condition again. The really, really weak ones, I do want to keep repairing. Just, just him. And we're going to go blockade all of Naples, and just see if maybe we can get them to peace out. Hey, cool, let's blow up Austria's fleet, sweet. Gladly. That's good. I mean, both of them are losing with the ticking war score. And they're not getting to Venice. Never gonna happen. You will not take our Venice. Looks like we got one, two, three, four sea zones. So we're gonna have to split the, uh, the fleet in fourths.
That puts us at 9%. No, wait. One, two, three, four. There's actually five. Damn. That'll have to work. We got the... Hey! Interest per annum. Sweet. Monte Nuovo. The original system of loaning in Italy was a joint stock fund where each citizen had to lend a certain amount of cash in exchange for interest, called Monte Vecchio. In the mid-15th century, Venetian bankers introduced a guaranteed minimum payment of interest to the lenders, which increased the amount of money people were willing to lend. This Monte Nuevo, Nuovo was extremely successful and fundi, funded many of Venice's wars. Lose inflation or take the reduced reduction in interest. Well, we did we did pick up a couple loans, so taking the interest rate down sounds very good. That lasts till how long? 1573, 100 years of 2% reduced interest. Sweet. Totally need to hire mercenaries and stuff. All right, you. Negative 23 reasons for concession of defeat. That is a lot of troops, Austria. I hope you're bleeding. I hope you're bleeding manpower. You have to be. Supply limit's only 26. You got 32. There's, you're bleeding manpower. You have to be. 10% war score now against you. Still, still can't even get them to surrender. Something that they would accept is if I just release Croatia. That's part of our trade node. We have cored it. It's the right culture and right religion. I really don't want to get rid of it. Well, I think it's the same culture group. Now it's accepted. Huh. I think I'm going to need to take Naples capital. Alright, so... Let's take these transports. Bring them over here. We're going to take just two infantry with our general guy. Send him into... I can stay there for now, I guess. Transports go to Treviso. We're going to send him down, and we're going to send him to Napoli. Napoli. Napoli only needs two, right? Yeah. And we're still going to try to peace out Hungary and Naples. Probably faster just to drop them off in Ancona and have them walk. Okay, well, as complicated as it is, I think we're going to take a break here, and uh, we'll see. God, that's a lot of troops. Jesus. We're at war with a lot of people. So that's apparently what happens when you have lots of, lots of aggressive expansion. So, cool. I'm going to take a break. I'll see you again in a little bit. Thanks for watching. See you soon.